Hello YouTube, I'm here to answer the simple question of which Android Wear launcher is better, Wear Mini Launcher or Bubble Cloud? Now you gotta take into consideration the first fact that the Bubble Cloud launcher does cost $2.50. Wear Mini Launcher is 100% free and it's a bit more dependable. But once you get past that, the Bubble Cloud launcher obviously looks a bit better. It kind of catches people's eye and it looks a bit like the Apple Watch, which you can't even pre-order yet. So it's pretty exciting. And you can also access your settings bar up there and still be able to do everything on your watch, like getting to your settings very easily and changing your device from vibrate to ringing and stuff like that with by clicking on that little icon right there and I'm not gonna lie to you it's not very easy to click on these little things I'm not gonna sit here and tell you that I could do it all day long but on some devices like the Moto 360 where it's circular it might actually even be harder so I think I'm actually got it pretty good here with the Asus Zen watch but for the Wear Mini Launcher, you can launch it just by taking your thumb and dragging on the left side of the screen, and there it is. I have uh, all my apps right here, which I can easily click on in 100% accuracy. I can click on it and know I'm going to click on it. But uh, the Wear Mini Launcher also has another settings bar right here so that you can change your brightness, you can turn on and off your Wi-Fi, and other things too. So I'm actually going to leave the Wear Mini Launcher on my device in case I ever need it and I just want to make sure I'm clicking on an app, but I might end up deleting it after a while. But for a bit, since I paid $2.50 for this, I'm probably going to use it just to see if I can get any more people's attention with it, because it's pretty cool looking. you got the clock right there, you got a uh, flashlight, all different types. you got the little um, Saturday, it says the 4th, that's the actual date right there. It's a great app. I definitely recommend it. I'll have both of the apps in the description below. So uh, to answer the short question, I would say this is the better launcher because it's fully functional it's really cool looking and it's pretty exciting so definitely check it out guys thanks for watching I'm Joey I like the way you click subscribe